So, are you all enjoying the trip until now, guys? Nice. Very nice. That's why I did not get on that bottle this time. He's so pissed off. Hi, guys. So, now we are outside the gate to go to the Roro ship. So, this is the gate. Welcome to the eastern waterfront. From here, we're going to hop on, take the car to Roro, and then we're going to go. All the way to Alibar. So see this captain with his son. Life after marriage. Who's the captain? Who's the captain here? Who's the captain here? Is it Lucas or is it Ricky? Look, where you're looking. See that?
guys just a few pointers about this house this house has a nice living space on the ground floor and it has two bedrooms one on the right one on the left and uh, they have a small loft like on top where you can chill they have some nice music system and some nice uh, pictures which are displayed so that's a chilling area but basically it has two bedrooms and two bathrooms and uh, it's a very comfortable place and uh, get away from mumbai one two days it's perfect and uh, the caretaker mr matri was really nice and he arranged for food also for us his wife so we just had to order from her and uh, we just paid him cash and uh, he arranged for really lovely local food fish chicken whatever you need rice bhaji and uh, there are even alcohol shops just around 10 minutes or 5 5 10 minutes from here there's a beer shop and alcohol shop everything is available there's a small market so that was really nice as you can see here they have a nice sitting area very pretty one they have good parking you can park your car lot of parking he told me not to park here because there's a coconut tree on top and you know coconut trees and cars don't do well they have a hammock so you can chill out lot of books inside and a lot of trees around these betel nut trees you can see these long these are the betel nut trees it's a plantation they have a nice sitting out area and chill out here and they have a swing which you can swing on whenever you like and as you can see inside the living space let's go inside you would see pet dog at the entrance you can see there the living space and here we have three bedrooms bedroom number 1 bedroom number 2 we have some nice sculptures of ours some nice pictures so you'll remember the place and they have a open kitchen with almost everything you can see they have a gas microwave a lot of utensils and they even have a fridge pretty big fridge you can store a lot of stuff and they have a library here We even have a sit-out area. You can even use this place. It's pretty. It's locked up, so it's safe. See, chairs and everything. And there are few houses behind, but to what we know, nobody lives in there. They are locked, so we're pretty much secluded. See this house. Nice chandelier. Now let's go up to see how it looks on top. You can chill out here on the. So there are some chairs. And there are some nice pictures. And that's the view from down. How it looks. So overall, I rate this house. Three out of five, and it was a good experience. And I hope many guys visit this home after seeing this video and uh, enjoy the local features of Maharashtra, which is close to Mumbai. Good morning, guys. So today is our last day at the villa, and we'll be heading back uh, around 11 o'clock. We have to check out and make our way to the Mandwa jetty, and we'll go back on the roller ship and back home. So. We had an experience out of this world. It was really fun. Just close to Bombay, around two hours, so that was really nice. And uh, I'm not feeling much tired, also because there was hardly any drive of two hours. Usually, if you come by a road, it's at least three to four hours to Ali Bag. But this roller ship is really nice for whoever wants to use it, and uh, it will cut your journey really short. Plus, you have the experience of. 
coming on with your car or without a car also you can come on the roller ship so it was a great experience and uh, we feel totally rejuvenated and now we're ready to go back